tile. The sink is next to the shower head, which is right almost under over the toilet. And basically, there was a little, you know, um, like you and I would use to, to rinse off the pots and pans. Oh, uh, a, a, a bidet. Right. A bidet. No, that wasn't even a bidet. It was like it was the hose with the little the little gun on in there. And so you, when you're done with your little whatever, you go and you know, That's you just like a little spritz. Because ever like in India, what? they think it's like totally disgusting. Oh yeah, no, they, they think, think they think Americans are disgusting. The yeah. fact that we don't wash ourselves mm -hmm. every time we death when we go to the bathroom, and mm -hmm. they think it's horrific mm -hmm. that and that we just do a dry wipe, and they're like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, Greg had Greg learned. Um, yeah, you learned some interesting things. After he told me his experience in the hospital, I thought I am never complaining about a hospital. <laughs> well, speaking of hospitals, we were, it was, when Greg had had his had the nurse, we um we went to visit, him, and he was still very delirious. Oh, this was during the hallucinating and yeah, the blood poisoning. And, uh, and oh boy! At, and we walked into the into the, 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 the room, and he's laying in bed. Well, not quite that much. He did lose quite a bit, but like, man. And he was, he says, I've lost 635 pounds. I said, really, Greg? I said, that's great. He said, this has been wonderful. And so I, we walk out, and, and Cheryl and I, okay, we have a conversation with him, and people like, said, okay, he's delirious, we got to get out. So we walk, and I'm like, we're in the elevator, and we're walking out of the hospital, like, did he say 635 pounds? Did he say this? Did he really say this? So then, Afterwards, I told you know, and he's like, when everything was all over, I was like, Greg, do you really remember being in love? Not really. I said, oh, <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> <laughs> so you don't remember saying that when you were in the hospital, you lost 635 pounds. <laughs> he over. I, I said that. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh yes, you said it. We all heard it. You lost six hundred thirty-five pounds. That's why you were so glad it was the best thing that ever happened to you. <laughs> so I must have been really out of my mind. You were literally. <laughs> you yes. <laughs> he had showed up at the house. He was late. He shows up at the house. He had he had rounded the corner, hit the uh, hit the curb, blew the tire on the car. Oh my! Shows up with the with the tie. Like he was so delirious. I, I know about this. He shows oh, up this is right before the right before he went into the hospital. Okay, this is when the blood poison was kicking yeah, in. Kicking in. He was he started to hallucinate and yeah. go out there. So he's like, "Well, we're here. I'm late. I'm sorry, Greg. We can't. Well, you gotta get in the car, Greg. You blew a tire, dude. You're gonna take my car. So and he was I always him, and he's just like, "Well." So we get down to the we get down to the to the um, to the high school and I'm like oh shit with this I am dealing with this right now so I go to the administration I'm like I need every one of you now and they're like what's the matter I said Greg is like completely delirious hallucinating and he's here so Bill Lavore walks down Bill Lavore was one of them there <laughs> and he's like he walks through and says Greg what the hell are you doing. I'm teaching. <laughs> You're not in any He's on the floor part of the time. He's in so much pain. He's like, I'm teaching. You're teaching. teaching. <laughs> I'm not gonna miss a day. Yes. I'm just not gonna miss a day. Good so work ethic. I, I, said, I said, do you need me to take him? No, no, no. Man. You got him. To, we'll, we'll get him home. They, they got him home, and they were like, you need to stay home. You need to stay home for a while, and. And it was like, 